Hi guys, so here I have a new guest with me. Introduce yourself. Uh, hi, my name is Hyun. I'm from South Korea. Now I'm friends with Kutia. So a few weeks ago, Hyun visited Finland. Mm -hmm. So we thought we'd have a little chat about his time there. Yeah. This was your first time visiting Finland, right? Yeah, that was my first time to visiting at the Finland. So what was your first initial impression? I really want to go to Finland because I really like to visit real nature countries because at Korea we know about the Finland it is like they have nice nature and like all the people they're really nice to like foreigners is that the stereotype Finland has in Korea yeah that was and that is why I really, I really want to go there so what did you think when you first got off the plane of course it's really cold it was winter time when yeah it was winter time January. yeah yeah it's generally it's cold but like it feels really like crushed to me but like when I visit like arrive at the Finland it feels like I came back to my home I don't know why you got yeah. picked up from the airport <laughs> that helps yeah yeah exactly <laughs> that would help to me and the first day you were in Finland you went around Helsinki right yeah what's the thing that stuck out most to you at the time I met my friends but like sh she was a little bit late so I just mm -hmm. look around by myself around at the main station and I just asked some people to which like which one do I have to visit at Helsinki mm -hmm. they were really nice to me because what you asked people on the street yeah on the street just they were really kind and they said to me like just go straight this way and just turn left and there's some really nice like white church at there so you didn't get the impression that Finnish people are withdrawn and cold no no I didn't <laughs> okay how about for people visiting Helsinki is there anything you would recommend seeing I recommend the white church is definitely good but I'm really sorry about that, but there's nothing very much to like tourist. There's not yeah, so like, much to do in Helsinki. Like tourist attraction things, mm -hmm. but like still they have good bars, restaurants. Oh, tell the story about. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what is his name? Saul Likoski. Saul Likoski. Like, I went to bar with my friends, and at the time, one guy, he just go to like the other guy. And they just took a picture together. So I just asked my Finnish friend, who is he? And he just told me that he's ex-boyfriend to Adam Lambert. <laughs> and I know like Katia is really big fan of Adam Lambert. So at the time I just really want to talk with him. So I just asked my friend, just give me more detail about him. <laughs> my friend told me that he was winner at some just like Finnish Big Brother. Yeah, that one. So I just went to him and just say hello and he said okay who are you and I said to him like oh I'm here from like Korea and he said oh Korea is really like far away from here why did you come here and I said to him like oh I met I want to meet my friend here mm -hmm. so that is why I came here and he said then how do you know me <laughs> I, I was so shame about that but like I talked to him that you were ex-boyfriend <laughs> with Adam Lembrandt and oh my god, you have to see his face. Like, oh, he just said to me that, uh, okay. But it's okay, because you know what? Saul Goskinen yeah. just went to LA last week uh -huh. and has been hanging out with Adam Lambert. Then they be together so again. So they're still friends, at least. Oh, that is okay. But like, at the time, I don't know what should I say because I'm really a bit like so tense to that. <laughs> Just bring up the ex. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and he was like, he laughed so loud at the time. Good experience. <laughs> yeah, it's really good experience. Meeting yeah. Finnish celebrity. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I, I have never expected that one. It was so fun. And one of the main reasons you wanted to visit Finland was because of the nature. Yeah. So how did you find it? Second day, we went to mm. some forest with like Katia's family. Oh, yeah. Siarvi. And oh my god, it's so beautiful. <laughs> we saw the ice swimming things. And I really want to do that, but I don't have any... Yeah, right! <laughs> I tried to get you to do it and But I don't have any spare, like, clothes. Does it matter? <laughs> but I really want to do that because that one is, like, weird, like, finished things. Yes, I see. Yeah, yeah. All on the I will do that maybe next time. We just walk through the forest. So much snow. Yeah. You were being a bully, throwing snow at me. Yeah. So fun. Uh, I 
And we went to the dog park. Yeah, yeah exactly. We went to Sydney. Did you learn any new Finnish words while you were there? <laughs> just a little bit Finnish, mm -hmm. like just normal conversation things like Moi, Ole Hanjin, Hauska, Tabata. Yes. Haista, Pasca. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, I didn't say it there. <laughs> and like Kitos. <laughs> the other one is the bad word, so I don't want to speak it here. Oh, bye bye. Bye bye. Moi moi. Yeah. Yeah. Got it. Good. <laughs> How about the food? Yeah, like at first time when I visited Helsinki with my friends, I just asked to my friends that I really want to eat reindeer because I heard that reindeer is kind of Finnish food. Yeah. Yeah. At the time we went to a restaurant, but it's really expensive, so I could get it. So I just said to your mom. I ate it and it just tastes like just normal meat, nothing special. But like compared to Sweden, Denmark, mm -hmm. and Austria Czech Republic, I think Finnish food is much better than them. Just in my opinion, <laughs> just in my opinion. <laughs> don't don't yeah. stare at me that. <laughs> and also we ate some the bakery things at night. Well, well. Yolo torto! Yeah, that one is really nice. I really like that. Christmas tarts. Mm. Yeah. I like that. We made them ourselves too. Oh, and then the glögi. Mm, yeah, yeah. That was good. I love it. So I took a picture of that one. So how did your first impression when you just got to Finland mm -hmm. differ from the end of your stay? It's quite similar and it was everything was so impressive to me. Was there anything shocking? Um maybe I swim. <laughs> Maybe I see me. Only that one. It'll be more shocking if you actually try to. I will. I will try. I will definitely. I really would you go to. back to Finland? Yeah, definitely. One hundred percent. I really enjoyed it at the time. And travel... you're not. And you're not just saying that because I'm. Yeah, yeah. No, of course not. Because I travel almost like twenty countries now, uh -huh. and the Finland and Switzerland is the best country to me. And also, like all of my last of my friends, they ask me. Like which country do we have to visit? And now I can say Finland is the best. Not not just for you. <laughs> <laughs> not just because I'm staring at you. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Finland is a really good place to visit, definitely. Well, you heard it from him. All right. So if you guys want to see some photos of his travels or you want to follow him on social media, I'll leave it in the links down below. So I guess that kind of concludes our chat here. Mm -hmm. I guess that just about concludes this video. Till next time. Bye.